All right, let's go YouTube. Starting another game series in between Call of Duty uh, Modern Warfare Trilogy. We're gonna start uh, with another platformer. I'm really into platformers recently because they're fun. And we're gonna start one that I remember playing a bit of. I don't remember how far I got into the game, but I have played at least some of Banjo-Kazooie. We're gonna start Banjo-Kazooie. There's three games in the series, at least in the main series, I think. And uh, we'll play those. Um, in between. So, yeah. Oh, daily quest ready to turn the game pass. Cool. Welcome in, Diggs, by the way, 7. Hope you're doing well. Welcome. Good to see you. Welcome to Banjo-Kazooie, the first stream. I remember playing this, like, a year ago, I think, and I got through... I th this is the thing. I don't remember too much about it. I got through a decent chunk of the game. Is that Sparks? Sparks is fucking flying there. Um... But I don't remember why I stopped playing it, but I never finished it. So, even though it's technically not blind, I'm still going to put blind up since I haven't finished the game and I don't remember much about it. I do remember it being pretty damn fun, though. Also, this theme song is Pog. Oh, right. That lady girl. Oh, yeah, that guy. Okay, now it's starting to come back to me a bit. Oh, I'm playing this on the uh, Xbox One. It's part of Rare Replay, by the way. God, these graphics look good. <laughs> Someone's going hard in the kazoo. <laughs> Hey, remember when Rare wasn't owned by Microsoft and they actually made good games? Good 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 times. They made a bunch, right? They made Banjo Kazooie, Donkey Kong, Killer Instinct. They were on like a hot roll in the 90s. Anyway though, Banjo Kazooie. Let's see if I still have that old save file. Oh, there we go. Wow, I actually got what, 10 hours? Holy shit. I didn't realize I played that much. I guess I got through 77 jigsaws and 700 notes. That seems like a lot. Okay, I guess I played through most of this and just never finished it. I'll erase that just so I don't get curious about where I was. Hmm. Let's go to, uh, oh, right. There's, like, the sleepy one. The I'm cooking some soup one. And then I'm playing a game. Oh, well, this is, yeah. Yahoo! Yahoo! I can't believe these guys got into Smash! Ooh, evil lair and such. Oh, yeah, this fucking music, too. I don't remember what this guy's name was, but man, this music is so good. <laughs> What's a nice looking wen wench? Oh, my God. Why, well, it's Grunty and Day. She really takes my breath away. Oh, right, it's all like. <coughs> Yes, you're right. I'm rather proud. My looks stand me out from the crowd. I know they have, like, voices, but I'm still going to do the voices since they don't actually say words. Er, uh, but there is this girl. What do you mean this cannot be? There's no one prettier than me. Why, it's Tootie, young and small. She's the prettiest girl of all. Is she, though? No, 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 you must be mad. Nicer beauty can't be had. Unfortunately, I think you'll find it's Tootie. She's cute and kind. Man, this guy's just shutting her the fuck down, dude. To be fair, she did just call herself a wench, so I mean... Well, we'll see about that. Oh my god, the fucking broomstick has a face. That's weird. Yo, these graphics... Good sound effect, too. Oh, right, the mole guy. Uh, hi there, Tootie. What are you going to do today? My big lazy brother. Can I, like, somehow make this go faster? Maybe not. We're going on an adventure. Cool. 
Yeah, what's up, Supa? With the bear. Uh, let's see, hold on. What's the name of that one? Bear pug, please. Bird pug, please. Bear pug, please. Bear pug, please. Bear pug, please. Bird pug, please. Hell yeah, bro. Hope you're doing well. Welcome to Banjo Kazooie. Not my first time playing it. I, as I just mentioned, I guess I played through most of this game and then never finished it. Although I don't remember like any of it. Maybe this is back when I got into Yakuza. I probably stopped playing this for Yakuza. Oh, sorry. Wait, Mr. Mole, I can't see him. Up there in the sky. Oh God. I don't think so. Who is that? Hope you're doing well, Super. Welcome in. Come to me, my little pretty. You'll soon be ugly. What a pity. This fucking, this fucking bitch. Let me go, you ugly old hag. Don't scratch and bite, my little bear. You'll soon need bigger underwear. Dude, that's literally me, though. Oh, no. She's got her. Somebody. Help. Banjo, wake up. Now. Or not. It's fine. You're... Sister only got. Yo, what do you want, Kazooie? Do you have a list of games you played stream? I have a suggestion if you haven't played a platform recently. I don't have a list, but uh, <laughs> Yakuza. Uh, suggest if you haven't played a platform. Sure, just say it, and I'll tell you if I have played it or not. We'll go from there. All right, let's do it. All right, I don't remember like anything. Oh, non adjustable camera. Oh no. Oh right, that button's to crouch. Okay. A Hat in Time. I have not played that one, but I've heard good things about it, though. What if that one's on Game Pass? Listen up, I'm Bottles, the short-sighted mole. I'm Banjo, and this here's my buddy, Kazooie. Sure is a strange-looking buddy, Banjo. Can it talk? Can I make this go faster? Okay, I can. All right, but it's like... <laughs> You know, maybe I won't do the voices just because listening to these fucking, like, voices are so good. I grabbed her. <laughs> Geeky? Man, that's mean. I feel like I would love it. I've heard good things about that one. I'm hella into platformers. Training, huh? Uh, press A. If you want me to teach you some basic moves, or press B if you think you're already good enough. Uh, I should be alright. You bet we're good enough, Bottle Brain. Cause we do do be mean. Yeah, I think I remember that being a trope. She's just like hella mean. All right, cool. <laughs> all right, so I have. Yes. Okay. Okay. Oh, right, I have, like, the hover. This game does look pretty damn... Oh, an adjustable camera, thank God. Hey, can you believe that in 1998, Banjo-Kazooie had an adjustable camera, but 10 years later, neither Eternal... Or, uh... 10 years later, Dawn of the Dragon... Spyro Dawn of the Dragon or Crash of the Titans and Mine of Mutant fucking didn't? Nani. Let's right, see if I can make it. Probably not. Oh, God. No, what? Oh, is that a fucking carrot? Oh, my God. And, like, an onion? What the hell? What the fuck's going on in this place? I'm scared. Hey, Mr. Is that an... What the fuck? Bonk. Health. Mmm. -hmm. I'm sticky, tasty honey energy. Okay. Thanks, man. Oh, that's what that is. They simply regressed. I mean, regressed is a pretty... Oh, fucking, what is that? Regressed is a pretty, uh... What's the word? Uh, I think giving them, uh... Or not harsh enough is what I mean to say. Oh, that's what I... Yeah, okay. Right, 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 right. The backflip, the backflip. Dude, it's Dwayne the Rock Johnson as Banjo. Oh my god, could you fucking imagine that? Look out for me! I'm an extra life! Do you imagine Dwayne Johnson playing Banjo? The fucking dream, dude. Alright, so now I can probably go grab that. So what I remember about this game is that... 
there's a lot of platforming, but it's not really too much about the platforming. It's more about the exploring, and this game is a collectathon. Uh, if you're wondering, um, maybe I'll go for 100%, but we'll fucking see. I remember this game being pretty tough to complete. Just because there's a lot of levels, I think. I don't remember much about my time playing this, because I think I got too caught up in Yakuza. Which, I'm, I've already pumped in... <laughs> Since I, uh, since Yakuza 0 came back to Game Pass, like, a month ago, I've already pumped in 70 hours into it. I literally did nothing, uh, this most recent Tuesday, Wednesday, but play Yakuza 0. I probably played for, like, 20 combined hours. Uh, I haven't seen a lot of it, but a lot of glitches, too, when watching speedruns. That's a good note. I'll have to see if I can find some glitches, just... Oh, wait, how do I, uh... I feel like there was a way to go way faster in this game. Maybe not that. What the fuck? Uh. Hey, guys. Yeah, probably because they're, like, breaking the game somehow. Almost as notable as, uh, or noticeable as, uh, Mario 64, but not nearly as game skipping. Oh, I see. Okay. We'll see how much the uh, Xbox, because I'm playing this on the Xbox One, for those that are wondering. This is not on the uh, OG and, like, Nintendo 64 or an emulator. I have a part of the Rare Replay that was on, uh... It's actually the Rare Replay, and I think, like, Gears of War 3 or something like that in a combo cartridge, or cartridge combo box, which is pretty funny. Oh, don't I have, like, a... Uh. Oh my god. Dude, I just I just had like a Mexican casserole, so this is gonna be my poop later. Uh-huh, that sounds about right. Oh, view totals, here we go. Oh, that is nice. It actually tells you how many Right, that was a good thing. It actually told you how many of like each. Hmm. Banjo Phoenix and Marcus Kazooie. <laughs> you heard it here, folks. Heard it first. Oh, yeah, I can swim. Cool. You said you didn't need my help, so you're on your own until you get inside. All right, fuck you, dude. I didn't even mean to activate you. Bonk. I need to collect the uh, other... Oh, there we go. Brody! Yeah, definitely not the best double jump. Oh, no. So close. I can't remember if I can dive or not. Oh, yes, I can. Right. And because he was the fucking paddles. Dude, look at that face up in the top left. It's a banjo and a kazooie pog at the same time. There we go. Oh, hold on a second. Don't think I don't see you, buddy. Like the seamless transitions between the underwater and overworld music, yeah. I, if I remember correctly, the soundtrack in this game is absolutely fantastic. Um, I don't remember who he, but he's the same guy that did Diddy Kong Racing's music, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, he's a goddamn genius. I think that's right. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure because they're very similar. Right, that was another great game that Rare made. Remember when Rare made Diddy Kong Racing, Donkey Kong Country, and Banjo Kazooie, and Killer Instinct? Holy shit, man. They were like the king of 90s gaming. This kind of blows my mind. How many do I have now? Three. Okay. Rare... Rareware was so fucking good, dude. And then they got... Oh, yeah. Grant, Grant Kirkhope. There you go. Yes. I can't believe I forgot his name because he's so good. You did one of his fucking... Or no, I'm sorry. Did you do one of his? Well, you did a cover of one of his songs. The Diddy Kong Racing theme. I remember Joey D did a bunch of his, uh... Maybe not a bunch, but I remember him doing some Diddy Kong Racing charts that were fucking awesome. Yeah, Grant's freaking great. I don't know if these are, like, the only two games. It's probably not, but, like, he is so good. Just those two alone are just so, like... <clears throat> such iconic soundtracks. I kind of look around for some more of these. I might have to go inside the mountain.
Oh, is there anything underwater there? I don't think there was. I don't know what those freaking like angry, angry like rocks of death. Joey did a lot of he did a lot of the Banjo Kazooie's. Nice. It's good. Like I said, man, these are some iconic soundtracks. Oh. Oh, David Wise is Diddy Kong? Oh, shit, never mind. Which other one did Grant do? I feel like he, uh... I feel like he did more than just this. Oh, it was, was it Conker's... It might have been Conker's Bad Fur Day is the other one I'm thinking of. I know he's done, like, a bunch of stuff. Dude, Diddy Kong Racing is such a good game. I'll have to play that on stream if I ever get the chance. Or actually, shit, is that in Rare Replay? Oh, I, I think Diddy Kong Racing might be the one game that isn't on Rare Replay. I could be wrong, though. I'll have to double check. So you're ready to tackle the witch now? We sure are. Show us the way, bottle boy. Cross the bridge to the enter Grotilda's lair. Look out for me inside. Good luck. Oh, yeah. Do duh. Donkey Kong 64. That's the other one. Oh, fucking hello there. I can make it. I can't make it. Oh, right. I forgot to take fall damage. Oh, I take fall damage. That sucks. And golden eye. Holy shit. Oh, wait. Oh, I can climb trees. I completely forgot about that. All right. There's one more somewhere in this area. Hmm. Donkey Kong 64 is not a, not a game I have played, but I definitely want to one of these days. Check up. Now, now I know I can climb trees. I forgot about that. Hmm. I wonder if it is over here in this, like, weird area with these fucking... Oh, you know what? Maybe the mole... Maybe I should enter and then... Oh, some... I'm already seeing some graphical bugs. Hey, fuck you. Oh, I'm gonna keep calling you. Don't do it again. Fuck you. Oh my god, he's erasing my save. <laughs> okay, fine. I'll fucking go. Wow, dude. He just legit straight up said he's gonna erase my save. No, no, no. Uh, not as fun if you're... Oh, sorry. It's a fun one. Not as fun if you're trying to go for 100. Ah, by that, I mean replaying levels five times over as each individual Kong. Well, good to know that if I ever play that, I'm probably not gonna go for 100%. Yeah, that's why, I, that's why I said with this one, too. I was like, I might go for 100%, but I remember this game being pretty tough. Especially the later levels, if I remember correctly, being like, fuck, man, it's hard to get everything. Alright, yeah, I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go in and I'm going to come back out, because then he'll probably be like, oh, fine, I'll help you. Because I feel like I missed something there. I honestly didn't mean to, like, you know, when it said the skip tutorial, I thought it was just the jump. Just a design flaw for DK64? Ah. This is fucking weird. Cutscene, maybe? Oh, my God. Who the fuck is that? Chungus is over there. You fat hag. Jesus. This one's much more manageable. <laughs> Klungo? I'm tired of being an ugly witch. Yes, Mistress Grunty. Power is on soon. Be ready. The <laughs> clunk clunk. Was his name Clunky? Cl clun Clundo? Klondike, but what would you do? Yo, did you hear they discontinued the Choco Taco? Like, not even memeing. They actually just discontinued it for, like, no reason. I remember seeing an article saying, like, yeah, Choco Taco's gone forever. <laughs> Rest in peace. Who knows? Maybe it'll come back, but from what I read in the article, it's gone. It's pretty good. It's, it's, I mean, it's not like the best, but it, it's pretty all right. I definitely just prefer a Klondike bar. What do you mean? I actually, like, I actually need help. Yeah, how do I do that? I feel like this is the ground pound, but I don't remember how to do it. Was it like. I 
Bro, I actually need help, though. I'm trying to press, like, every button, but it's not working. Wait, actually, can I just look at my controls? Help and options. Here we go. Uh, controls. Uh, dive. Oh, maybe I haven't learned it yet. How to play. I should not have skipped the tutorial. I did not mean to do that. Uh, hold it there. Jumping pack, roll attack, claw swipe, swim. Oh, right, the egg firing. Uh, I think I've had one once. Like I said, it's pretty good. I just prefer a Klondike bar, though. Right, there it is. L tier, RT, but I don't know if I have that yet. I might have to unlock it. Yeah, I might have to come back for this. I could have sworn I was able to get all this shit before, but maybe not. And for the longest time, I've never had one. Now I hear this. It's over, man. Like I said, they'll probably bring it back at some point, but... Oh my god, dude. I literally just want to know how to do this thing, but... Alright, fine. Maybe I should just restart the game. Nah, it's fine. We'll, we'll feel, figure that out later. Who knows? Maybe I'm totally wrong. I got stuck in a tree. Onion in a tree. Oh my god, he's flying. What the... Brother? Brother! There we go. Alright, well, whatever. Or cauliflower. Yeah, maybe cauliflower. <laughs> kind of look like an onion. Onion flower. Oh, no, that's more of an onion down there. Dude, cauliflower is not great. I remember having that in my first job because I lived... Or I lived... I worked at an Indian cuisine restaurant, and they had cauliflower, and I tried it. It was... It's weird. It's, it's fucking weird. The <laughs> whole... Okay, if I also remember correctly, although the overworld or like the hub world is fucking cool, I remember getting to the levels to be a pain in the ass. Hmm. First world. Oh, yeah. You need to flavor it up for it to be good. That's fair. If I, if when I just eat it like regularly it wasn't great but yeah if you put some uh, spices on it some sauce some butter and garlic yeah you get butter and garlic and like everything hey it's me mr jiggy now go and find a picture with a piece missing okay did you just fucking eat it oh just eat it eat it eat it eat it get a couple eggs and eat it or beat it whatever Oh god, the seamless transitions into the fucking, like, overall themes is so good. The limit six bases with the jigsaw pieces. Goggle boy. Great! God, I love it. God fucking, because they keep insulting me. I love it. I mean, uh, insert the thing in the thing. I did it! Mumbo's Mountain. The others may just test your wit. Oh, they sure will. I remember this game getting pretty hard at some points. Oh, enemies! Three new moves to learn. Ah, okay, there we go. Bonk. Find my molehills, and I'll explain. Right, I gotta remember to not hit these guys until I uh, actually need health. Oh, the ball! Oh, yeah, those fucking guys. I'm a note of one of a hundred on each world. Collect us to open the note doors. Okay. Oh, yeah, these guys, too. What are these guys' names again? Shit. Yippee, you say, me. Vertilta has imprisoned five of us j Jinjos on each world. It sounds like Jingu from fucking Yakuza. Jinjo! Oh, right, okay. It's kind of like a Mario thing. The super slow one or, like, the fast one? 
Oh, hit detection is so so good. Yeah, they kind of do look like Pokemon. Gotta catch them all, Gingomon. They only say Ginger when you find them. I'm probably gonna turn this down. Most of this game gets really loud for some reason. Like really loud. Ginjo! God, the mouth on that guy. Oh yeah, that's right. They go like Ginjo! Oh, I think I remember this. No! Oh yeah, this guy too. I got a skull. Am I am I Shakespeare? What the fuck? Jumpy jumpy. Did that bull just moo? Excuse me? Oh boy. Get him. There we go. Oh, how'd I fucking Uh oh, I guess I can only stun him. Hey man, what's your deal? Oh I got him. Cool. Oh, grab the shit. I'll keep that one for later, I guess. Oh, cool. Like, this is like a staircase. Nice. Oh, God. Ants. No. Ants in my pants. Bonk. Alright, so I'm just gonna keep these guys. God, the seamless transitions are so good. Even in just new areas of the same world, there's, like, different music for each thing. Attention to detail is so good. One of your eyes. Are you Machima? There we go. Yes. Ten of us on each world will help you progress through the witch's lair. Hell yeah. Okay, gotcha. Thank you, Goggly Gogglies. Hell yeah. Probably nothing up here. Nope. <laughs> but I see you down here. Don't think I don't. Me, Mumbo's token. Use for Mumbo's magic. All right, cool. Thanks, man. Oh, what was the deal with this fucking... We Juju Mumbo Stotem Pole feed us with nice blue stones. <laughs> uh huh, okay, now I remember. Uh, killing the ants really threw me off when I was little since sometimes you just saw an eye bouncing around. Ow. Oh, yeah, it's true. They, they, like, fucking explode. That's pretty graphic, actually. Especially for a kid's game. They straight up just blow up. Alright, where are these fucking molehills? I want to find those first. Bam, bum, bum, bum. Make sure I didn't miss any. Oh, ow, ow. Fucking ow. Bullfighting, bitch. Stunned you. Oh, cool. This thing actually stayed here. I thought it was going to despawn. But it didn't. Oh, yeah, this guy. DK? Grr. This Congress tree, me hit bear with oranges. Oh, okay. I remember, or not remember, but I. Haha! -ha! Clever bear fight Congo's gold. Bitch! Uh! Yo, what's up, Scarecrow? Good to see you. Hope you're doing well, man. Welcome. Some ban. Banjo Kazooie. Chimpy hungry. Wants orange now. Feed Chimpy. Uh. You throw it over here, brother. Hey, man. I need you to throw this over here. Alright, I'll figure that out later. Alright, can I, like. Oh, no, I think this is where I need the, uh, the eggs. The eggs Benedict. There's a bunch of them up there. This music. <laughs> Very percussive. Ooh. 
Okay. Um, let's keep going up this way. I've got to learn some moves first, if I remember correctly. Ooh. This seems like a trap. Oh, I guess not. Okay. For sure thought that was going to be like a trap. Like the thing clamps down on me and eats me or something. Also, there's a... Jinjo! Did you just whistle at me? No! No, I could do it! Haha! -ha, got him! Speedrun strats! Maybe, but probably not. Oh, another one of those, too. Yeet! Haha, -ha, eggs! Look how bouncy they are. Where the eggs Kazooie can learn to use us as ammo. Well, fuck. Sorry, eggs. You guys are totally screwed. All right, let's learn this move before I fall down the, uh, fall down the shit. The Talon Trot will let Kazooie tackle steep slope. Aha, yep. That sounds useful. How does she do it? Hold the right trigger, then press the left trigger. Continue to hold the right or left trigger while moving. Yeah, okay. Kazooie around with the left stick. Go practice. All right, remember how I was like, hey, how do you move faster in this game? Right, it's this. You go turbo fast. Fast as fuck, boy. It's kind of nice that I could do that to right myself. Yippee, you've collected enough notes to break the first note door. Hell yeah, that was easy. Oh. Welcome to the tutorial level. <laughs> like, oh god, this big fat fuck on my back. You ever run up and down a cliff at the same speed? <laughs> Alright, so you can just stand on a cliff too. That's fucking rad. Oh, yeah, she has, like, a, a relatively high jump, too. T no. Nice slide. Whoop. Because I don't have bird legs, that's fair. You've got to have the bird legs, man. If you don't have the bird legs, you can't do the thing that we said. Oh, there's another Jiggy over there. Good Jiggy. <laughs> like the Tiny K. Shout out to Tiny K. And yoink. Nice. Banjo, you cannot take credit for that. Kazooie did all the work there. You just sat on the back and played, like, I don't know, Banjo-Kazooie on the Game Boy. If that even exists. But it probably did, because they probably they made, like, a Game Boy, um, like, version of every fucking game imaginable. It does, yeah. I figured. Whatever, if there's a game on any console, guaranteed there's a Game Boy version of it. To overhead and the, and also they usually change it up because they don't want to make it the same exact game. They turn this into an overhead racer. I mean, granted, you know, Banjo was in Diddy Kong Racing. I guess it's fair. Hey, ugly! No bears allowed in in Ticker's Tower. I see why it's called that. Oh, what the fuck! Hmm, not sure if I can do that yet. Maybe we'll just do it like normal. Ooh, I can't even. Okay. Hmm. Okay, I might not be able to do this yet. Unless I get cheese in. No, okay, we're good. There's two of them? How? <laughs> Actually, how, though? Alright, how do I spit eggs out my b-hole? <laughs> Sounds really bad. Oh, uh, yes. One named Banjo-Kazooie Grunty's Revenge and the other as Banjo Pilot. Is that literally just a flying game? I fucking hope so. Uh, so no, not swim. Oh, here we go. Egg firing. Hold either uh, left or right trigger, then Y to shoot an egg out of your mouth. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you can press Y to shoot it out the mouth or B out it from the behind. Because, you know, why not, right? 
I remember that being like... Oh! So I could do this. Oh, I haven't learned it yet, though. Well, then why the fuck would they tell me that if I haven't learned it yet? Darn it. The game's teasing me, dude. Uh, fun fact is Banjo Pie was supposed to be a successor to Diddy Kong Racing, but they scrapped it to be only Banjo Kazooie. Ooh, that would be cool. Diddy Kong Racing. Yeah, we never did get a Diddy Kong Racing 2, did we? That's a bummer. That game was so good. Definitely like a unique racer. And when you compare it to Mario Kart 64, they're both really good in their own, like, unique ways. Fam, I need your help. Can I, like... So what's up if, if I get hit by this? Okay, I get hit. Come, good, good shot. I don't really remember what to do here. I might... I might. Ha it's one of those things where... I feel like I had to backtrack in this game a few times, if I remember correctly. It'll eventually come back to me somewhat, even though I never finished this. I think I at least learned. Oh, wait, no, that's that's the one I already did. Oh wait, I can I can go into freaking uh, that guy's uh, chambers, right? Ekum bulkum. Oh, here we go. I didn't even see this over here. Brr. The beak buster. Jump into the air, then press the right or left trigger to sink a suit. Okay, here we go. This is the ground pound. I don't like the sound of that, Banjo. Get used to a nest girl. You'll be using it a lot. Hmm, your energy is a little low. I'll fill it up for you. Oh, low? I only lost one. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Uh, could help Banjo. Filthy feathered one. Watch it, hut boy. Mumbo's magic tokens hit by witch. Find tokens and Mumbo help you. Banjo not got enough tokens. Okay. Oh my god, you can speed it up. It actually speeds up the voice, too. How. Uh, how for its. How, wait, what? How for it mean to learn Beak Buster from one who has no beak? That's fair, man. That's fair. See, you got like that 20 billion IQ. Dude, freaking Bird Boy has no idea. Or excuse me, uh, whatever Kazooie called him. I slaughtered the Grand River comedic effect. It definitely threw me off. So if that was your intention, good job. I was reading that like four different ways. Like my brain was like, hold on, what? Oh, get up there. Precise platforming. Wait, I might not even need to double jump. Okay, I definitely don't need to double jump. There we go. Alright, carefully. Grab all the eggs. Alright, I've got 17 eggs. I can make a fucking real good omelet. Dude, McCrae's has a 12 egg omelet, and my mom and I are 100% going to try that at some point. They got one pound burgers and 12 egg omelets. I can't even imagine that. Like, just eating like a three and four egg omelet at the Oink Cafe when I was in Arizona was already enough. I mean, was... But yeah, fucking... That's a, that's a lot of eggs. More than all omelets, Jack. Jesse, that's a lot of eggs. All right, where the hell is the last... Hill of the Mole. Mole, 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 mole. Where are you, you prick, prick, Sir Prixalot? Oh, it's up there. Can I crush you? Right, how do I get the fucking orange? I, like, don't remember. Oh, oh, right, I can climb trees. Duh. Derp. <laughs> Dude, look at that chungus orange. Oh, Chippy like Kaga's orange. Chippy help fat, fat, fat barren bird. So you're calling her fat too, right? Like, not just me? Just, just making sure. 
got to be equal. Oh, oh God. God, right? Fat bear and... God damn it. Fat bear and bird. All right, now we're in business. I'll have to go back out and see if I can get those that last uh, like health upgrade thing. Time for the buzzer to le learn the ancient ways of the whatever. I'm listening, Beetle Breath. Hold the right or left trigger, then press Y to shoot an egg out of your mouth. Hey, sounds cool. Anything else? Sure, press B instead and you can shoot them out from behind. Sheesh, sounds painful. I wish I'd never asked. Bird Brain could carry 100 eggs in her backpack. Oh, and you can also use the left stick to aim while you were crouching. Exciting, huh? <laughs> now that you've learned to use the eggs, here's 50 to practice with. Whoa, Banjo, there's nothing more I can teach you on this world. Thanks, man. The fucking buzzard. Damn, son. Uh, bonk. Oh, hell yeah. Get fucked, Gruntilda. Wait, how did he say to fuck? Whoops. Hold on. Wait, how did he say the fucking... Oh, wait. God damn it, I just read it and I already forgot. I suck. How to play. Okay, uh... Uh, damn it, it doesn't... Fuck. No, God. We have to go back. I gotta ask him the thing again. I, I am sucks. Teach me again, oh wise one. Okay, hold the right or left trigger and press B instead. You can use the left stick. Okay, left stick to aim while you are crouching. Okay. So I guess it's just like... Okay, I, I gotcha. Alright, I gotcha now. Oh, shit. Think you're safe, bitch? Think you're safe? Oh! Ow! Alright. That sucked. Bitch. Good miss. Uh-uh. Oh, my God. You whore. Uh, bear, beat conga. Me give prize to bear. You damn right will, bruh. You were, you were mean. That guy straight looks like Donkey Kong Jr. Hi. My name, my name is Donkey Kong. Yeah, my name it is Donkey Kong Junior. Fuck! Shout out to Star Bomb. All right, let's go and do some more shit. Check our totals real quick. All right, six of ten, zero of two. All right. But now that we've learned the, uh... oh my God, the excellence. The excellent ha 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 thing. I could probably. Oh, did I grab enough of those tokens? I do. Okay. Uh, we can go do the egg thing over here. All right. Shit. Oh, maybe I have to do it from here. Oh, wait, no, this is for this. Bonk. There we go. Right, I can bash stuff now with my really hard beak. Let me get a little bit more distance here. There we go. Just has to be a little bit more precise. Fast as fuck, boy. Oh, easy sauce. Oh, those shit. Did I, did I miss the uh, thing? 
crap. Ooh, I can make that. Oh, maybe I can't make that, though. I may have fucked it up already. Damn it. But I wonder if I could respawn those. Yeah, I probably can. I'll have to leave and come back in a second. Alright, now let's see what happens with this. Ah, oh, Banjo has plenty tokens. Stand on scroll and press X to see mighty mumbo magic. I am an ant. Mumbo's magic free to change back. You come when ready. Term oh, it's a termite. Bit small, but not bad for first spell. Mumbo practice needed. Okay, I guess it's a termite, not an ant. My bad. Oh my god, dude. Look at me go. I'm the fastest termite alive. I'm gonna eat that entire house in a day. All right, now I can do this. Aha. Ha ha ha. I'm infiltrating. Oh god, the camera though. Hey, having a fixed camera like sometimes is pretty rough. Okay, let's kind of like There we go. Oh, never mind. I'm so good at jumping. It's amazing that I like platforms and I can't even jump on the platforms. There we go. Where did you get those shorts? I want them. Get the fuck out of my way is where I got these shorts. That guy's jealous because I got some fucking shorts. A and a backpack. Shit. We talking about nuts and bolts? Uh, when? I don't recall talking about nuts and bolts. But uh, if I did, I don't remember. Give me that cool backpack or else. Shut up, bully. I'm gonna leave now. Bye. Bitch. You ain't getting this backpack or this pingus. Shout to the one up. Nice. Alright, let me kind of... Uh... Oh, Super mentioned a racing game. Uh, he was talking about one of the two Game Boy games. The band... Because we were like... I was making a joke like, oh... You know, this game's probably got a fucking... Um, game Boy game, right? And it turns out it has not one, but two. And I guess uh, one of them was a racing game, Banjo Pilot. Yeah. That's what we're talking about. Not Nuts and Bolts, although I know that is a racing game. Which seems weird for this series. I'm curious to see what that... Because that's the newest one, right? That came out... That's the newest one that came out, like, what? 15, 16 years ago? This is another series that needs, like, a reboot. Why do they keep killing off the platformers and never bringing them back? I wonder if people are just, like, sick of this type of game or something. Alright, so... Oh, I'm so close. Alright, we won't worry about that for now. I'm gonna have to go back in this level anyway. One of these is gonna have some good shit. Nuts and Bolts' badge is different. Gotcha. Especially for it being like a 360 uh, game. I can't wait to see what the graphics look like, considering that these graphics are really good already. Bonk. Oh, there you go. That's the last one, baby. God, the why does it get so damn loud? It gets so loud whenever I grab that shit. Volume goes from like 2 to 11. Why not just have it go to 10? Because this one goes to 11. Ow, by the way. Eight lives, though, Pog. Bonk. Oh, that's the last one. Oh, shit. Never mind. Nice. Hey, can you believe that the first level was fucking easy? Ukulele games? Yeah, I actually have... um. I think the first ukulele game on that was free with gold, so I will play. I was actually thinking about maybe playing that one 
instead of Banjo Kazooie. But I'm like, nah, I'll uh, I'll start with Banjo Kazooie and then move into Ukulele because that's kind of like a yeah spiritual successor or side game. But I actually was thinking about playing Ukulele first for a brief moment. I know I have the first one. I don't think I have the second one. All right, so all that's left in this level is the honeycomb, I think. Yes, yeah, so there's one I missed, and the other one I'm not really sure where. Look like fun games, though. I think they were made for the newer generation of consoles, too, which is nice. They should look pretty damn fire. Also, once again, ukulele. Good play on words. Oh, right. I think I remember how to get this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Okay, hold on. Well, I had to go back in anyway, so let's do it. All right, so I gotta—I know where that one honeycomb is. Now the other thing is, where is the other one? Double the honeycomb. All right, so let's get this down to like the third one, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I suck. Double sucks. All right, let me see if this works. Nope, one more. Possible layer is uh, more... Oh, the second one is 2.5D. Possible layer is more like Donkey Kong. Ooh. Well, I've never played Donkey Kong, but I definitely want to try it out. Oh, okay, I need one more. You spin me right round, baby, right round. Like a record, baby, right round, round, round. Okay. Oh, cool, I got another honeycomb. More life, baby. Big pog. All right, now where the hell's the other one, though? There's one more in this level. Maybe it's over here. I don't know if I explored everything over here. Eggs. Grab these. I love how bouncy they are. I love how the eggs look different than any other thing in this game. Hmm. Donkey Kong Country and Country 2 are essential to my childhood. Yeah, I definitely miss those. I grew up with the uh, Crash, uh, Wrath of Cortex, Twin Sanity, and Nitro Kart, Halo, Fable 1, or the Halo series, Fable 1. And um, got a lot more games. Just the ones that I can think of at the top of my head. A lot of Mario games. Mario 64, 3D World, uh, Galaxy 1 and 2, Smash Bros. Brawl. Pretty much anything on the Wii. Double Dash. I know that was GameCube and stuff. Quintessential. Crash Tag Team Racing, even though it sucks cock now. <laughs> That one was one of the ones I loved playing as a kid. Not as much as an adult. The game's pretty bad. <laughs> Once Sierra took over, all those games were pretty bad. <laughs> it's a real shame, too. It's funny that Sierra kind of, like, quad I mean, not kind of. 100% ruined both Spyro and Crash when they took over. Like, publishing. Because, I mean, although the Legend of Spyro games are not terrible, minus the Eternal Knight, they're not nearly as good as the, uh, as m every other Spyro game minus Eternal, um, Enter the Dragonfly. And same thing with the uh, Crash. All three of those Sierra games are, in my opinion, the worst Crash games ever. Especially Crash the Titans. But it's like, and both of those series died off for a while until Spyro got, uh, reimagined as, a uh, what was it, Skylanders? And the Crash didn't have another mainline game for another fucking, what, 14 years? Or 12, if you don't count, uh, um, Insane Trilogy. Where the hell is this last honeycomb? Oh, wait, can I, like, I can, like, look around. I should probably do that. Might be, oh, hi there. There, I'm glad I did that. I think I might just have to fall down.
Aha! There we go. Alright, cool. Donkey Country is fantastic. I'll have to try it out one of these days. Emulation, maybe. We'll see, though. I got too many other games to play. I was actually really like, it's like, man, what do I want to fucking play? Like, in between uh, COD. In between COD. And I was like, well, I mean, I'm going to play y Yakuza 2 is going to be the next game we play after uh, Modern Warfare 2. I was going to try and save that for a little bit later, but I just really want to play more Yakuza. And uh, then I was like, well, I don't know. I mean, I could play Celeste. Eh. And I was like, I could play Cuphead again. Not yet. I was like, oh, Banjo-Kazooie, though. Platform. Another platformer. I like me some platformers. Switch only has the uh, trilogy. Oh, you have to do it online, though. I see. Part of, like, the Switch. Oh, right. They have, like, the N64 expansion pack or whatever it's called. Celeste is so good. I'll play that eventually. Like I said, dude, I mean, I... Actually, we could probably check. How many fucking games do I have? That's fine. Just on the Xbox One alone, I've got like 89 games or something like that. And I've only played probably like 10 of them. Maybe more than that, but you know what I mean. So many games. Duck Kong Country's on the SNES. Ah, I see. Oh, right, the Super Nintendo thing. Do I want the shorts? There we go. Yeet. All right. Oh, wait, why'd I go? Oh, no, I have to go back to change, right? Man, don't you love it when there's backtracking on the fir first level? Yeah, I forgot. I think this game has a heavy reliance on uh, backtracking, unfortunately. Although the termite is adorable. Ever Celeste is a good game. I've heard it's also very difficult. <laughs> like, very difficult. Cool. Alright, bye. Alright, now it's time to go fast. Sonic Heroes! Oh, sorry, wrong game. Uh, bit a 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 uh, I only play, uh, sorry, challenging, just a Super Meat Boy can be challenging. Yeah, I remember playing Super Meat Boy uh, a while ago, and that was one of the hardest games I have ever attempted. Oh my god. I think I got through like half that game, and then I had to stop because it was so so challenging. But that'll be another one I eventually play. Oh, did I not have to backtrack? Oh, rip. That's alright. Change myself. Oh wait, I need to go back over here. Fast as fuck, boy. Yeet. All right, I take fall damage too. I gotta be careful. Let's just run down the mountain. You'll be coming round about it when she comes. You'll be coming round about it when she comes. And you. There we go. Sorry, rocks. Bonk. And the yoink bonketh. And uno more. Perfect. Cool. Alright, so I guess I did need to backtrack there. Nice. Oh god, I can't see. Whoop. What the fuck? Camera, please? How does fucking Kazooie fit in that backpack, by the way? Like, actually how, though? <laughs> is, it, is it like Hermione's bag or something? What the fuck? Is there really only two? Uh, maybe I'm just remembering it wrong. I mean, like I said, I played this game, like, probably a year, a year and a half ago, and... I guess I got through more of it than I thought. I got through like 700 notes and 60 or 70 jigsaws, but I just don't remember that because I think I got too sucked into Yakuza. This is a note door sealed by Grunty with one of her powerful magic or musical spells. Open it up then, jam jars. God, I hate you. It's not that simple to open it. You must collect the musical notes from the worlds. How many do we need? 
The number on the door is the strength of the spell. The combined total of all your best note scores from the worlds must be at least this to break Grunty's magic. Cool. Yeet. Yes! Got it. I did it. Oh. Hey, man. What the fuck? Hello there, young ones. I'm Brentilda, Gruntilda's nicest sister. I've crept down here to help you defeat the old hag. It's about time she was taught a lesson. I know all of Grunty's disgusting secrets, and I'll tell you three of them every time you find me. Remember them well, young ones, as they will help you avoid a fiery fate. Press X if you'd like to hear them. Yes, please. Grunty brushes her rotten teeth with moldy cheese flavored toothpaste. Moldy cheese. Engine oil. Okay. Saggy Maggie's Boutique. Okay. I'm never going to remember these, but you know what? That's fine. <laughs> Something for later. Shock jump disc? Bonk. <laughs> Rawr. Dead. You are not intimidating. Oh, hey, man. You activated a magic cauldron. Find two... Find two the same color to create a shortcut. Wait, find two the same color? Is there supposed to be an oven? Maybe I'm just totally wrong about that. Find two the same color. I mean, I guess that technically makes sense, but... I feel like there should be an oven there, but maybe I read that wrong. Your butt will tell you, and you'll know when my boot swings to and fro. All right, cool. Cool rhymes. Dude, Eminem better watch out. All right, so... Right, this is where the fucking overworld starts getting confusing, I think. Yeah, yes. Yep, I remember this. Yeah, I don't think I'll do that yet. I'm just going to... I might just go level by level. So I think I remember my other playthrough, like, just trying to explore the overworld and then getting lost. Because <laughs> it's huge. I guess I should say not the overworld, the hub world. Treasure Trove Cove. Uh, move the right stick down, but once the picture is complete, all the pieces are stuck there permanently. Okay, that's fine. Nice. Hell yeah. Oh, right. I forgot. They don't fucking... They don't, like... You don't just go into level. It opens somewhere else, and then you have to, like, find it. Might be your favorite theme in the game. I think I remember Treasure Trove Co. I think it's down here. Being pretty damn, like, a good theme. Oh, but what's this? What's this? What's this? I'm sick of all your shit! Oh, get the egg. God, hit detection. What's over here, though? Uh -huh. Oh, hey. What's up? Uh, nickname was C C Cauldron Butt. All right. Also know that sweaty gorilla feet is... Jesus Christ. Oh! This woman just, like, is the definition of gross. Gross and green. Alright, so... Click clock wood, huh? Damn, you need a lot, don't you? Did I watch the Game Gross episode with Grant Kirkhope? I did not. I kind of forgot they, uh... They did a guest scrums with them. That's rad. Great composer, dude. The soundtrack is so good. And the seamless transitions between like all of the uh, all of the like music is so good. Just such a good touch. Oh, what's up here? Hmm. hmm. Bonk. Bonketh. 
No. Come on, baby, light my fire. You watch this so many times. Sounds like a good one. I'll have to watch this sometime. I recently saw that, uh, I don't watch Green Grimms, like, too much nowadays, except for certain series, but, uh, except for 10 Minute Power. We always watch the 10 Minute Power Hour because they're so fucking good. But, uh, t Green Grimms just hit 10 years, which is wild to think about. 10 years of grumpage. Isn't that crazy to think about? I think that's, like, try to think of the only two, like, channels I think that have hit 10 years are, or that I watch, or actually, no. AVGN is the one that I is like the oldest of mine. He's been around since like the mid 2000s. Catacris has been around for 10 years plus now. And Game Grumps. Holy shit. Yeah, I've heard it's not as great now. But I still like to watch their older series. Like I recently rewatched uh um like their entire Twilight Princess playthrough from 2019, 2020, and that's a fucking good one. Hell yeah. Yeah, this, uh, I remember this music. Oh, God. The good switches, though. When there was, like, a family of them, yeah. Times change. People change. Channels change. That's why there's, like, certain things like that that I like, though. That's why I like AVGN, because even though he's gotten older, he still really hasn't changed, like, how he operates. Like, yeah, he's gotten a little bit more mellow because he's a fucking dad. And he's in, you know, he's 40 years old now, but, like, or I think 41, maybe. Maybe even 42. He might be 42 now. But, like, he's still, you know, he's still doing the nerd, and he still curses, like, the hell out of it and makes, like, a meal of it. And it's, like, and it's, like, that's why I love ACDC so much. ACDC is, like, the one band on planet Earth that has not once changed their sound. Our Jontron also hasn't changed much either, yeah. Except he's just gone to doing a more, like, video. Oh, I guess Jontron's another one that's been around for 10 years now, too, hasn't he? Fuck, man. Crazy to think about, to think about how long these channels that I've watched have been around. Uh, but yeah, he's, he's mostly gone to do, like, videos and stuff instead of games. Hey, man, why are you sad? Why are you sad, Mr. Walrus guy? <laughs> oh, my God. What the fuck? Bro, did you just, like, drink an entire 12-pack of Coca-Cola? What the fuck? Hold on. What the f No, talk to him again. Talk to him again, damn it. God damn it. All right, fine. It's just all burps. What the fuck? Yeet. Alright, what do we got? Ooh, there's like gold down there. Ahoy there! I be Blubber's treasure. Muddy, 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 muddy. Ooh, this is some weird control. Anyway, that's what I was saying about ACDC. Like, they're the only band, at least that I know for the most part, that, like, have not once changed their sound. From the 70s to today, they're still just good old hardcore rock and roll. Yeah, the times have changed and their music's gotten a bit more, like, you know, well-produced and shit, but, like, they're still... I think... I remember seeing uh, on Wikipedia that Angus Young made a joke. He was saying, like, I'm really getting sick and tired of people saying that we made the same album 11 times in a row. We've actually made 12. <laughs> and I just found that so good. It's like, yeah, man, you know what you're good at? Don't fucking change it. Here's one. Oh my fucking god. Um, that's why I love ACDC. Speaking of which, I gotta get like all their songs on my fucking playlist again. This guy's sad as fuck, dude. Oh, you see that angry treasure chest up there? Chicken legs. It's time for you to fly. At last, it better be easy. B bogeys simple enough even for you bird brain just stand on a flying disc and press a here's 25 th things to do uh, this thing your energy is a little low i'll fill it for, for you hey thanks man don't mind the fact that kazooie just keeps calling you names a few singers that don't change exactly and i love them 
Oh god, Ellen John's still amazing, yeah. Wee! Uh. I remember when I saw The Offspring a few years ago, I mean, fucking Dexter Holland, you know, he's not the greatest singer on planet Earth, but he still sounds pretty much the same as when he did in the, uh, in the 90s. I was actually very impressed with how good he still sounded. And I mean, I can't really say that. He's a great singer. Just a very particular type of singing, you know, punk and pop punk. But I mean, yeah, I saw him in like 2018, 2017 and 2018, and he still sounded just the same. On the water. Yep, we're good. When we saw Aerosmith, I mean, Steve, like, back in 2015 or 16, Steven Tyler didn't sound any fucking different. And he's in his, like, 60s now. And we recently saw, um, um, the most recent concert I went to was, uh, Korn and Alice in Chains. I don't know, I didn't know much about Korn, but he sounded great, and I mean, shit, even though there's no Lane Staley anymore, because he's fucking dead, like, uh, Alice in Chains still sounded amazing. Their singer, or their, excuse me, their singer slash guitarist Jerry Cantrell still sounds very good. And he harmonized as well with the, uh, the new singer, uh, William Duvall. They were very good. I'm gonna be seeing Ninja Sex Party in November, by the way. I am so, so fucking excited. Now, this is barring any, you know, if anything happens with, you know, the Backstreet Boys reunion tour. But I am so, so excited to go see NSP. They're touring, for those that don't know, of anyone that likes NSP. They're doing an acoustic tour with Super Guitar Bros and uh, their producer, Jim Roach. And they're coming to Portland. And I'm, I fucking immediately, when I saw that, I'm like, okay, I have to get tickets, <laughs> like, now. Where's that? Uh, they're playing at Revolution Hall in Portland. They're also playing in Washington, I believe, too. But, uh, U.S., I should say, specifically U.S. U.S. Acoustic. It's their first tour in over two years. Or it actually might have been three years. They never leave America? They, they do. I remember they did a European tour, like, a few years ago. I don't know if they tour outside the U.S. often, though. I just remember hearing that they did their first one, like, a few years ago. European, like just outside the U.S. tour. But yeah, it's kind of rare. I mean, they're still not like... I mean, they're a decently sized band, but they're not like a massive, massive band. So it kind of makes sense, like, you know... Do a tour like that, you kind of have to have, like... You know, you know what I mean. But uh, nonetheless, I mean, this is going to be my first concert since uh, <clears throat> the Backstreet Boys reunion tour began. And uh, I'm very excited because uh, we saw Corn and Allison Chains right before the Backstreet Boys reunion tour started. Like it was, I think, like seven months, maybe less than that, before it started. And so I haven't been to another concert since then, and I'm super excited. Don't worry, the turkey does all the work. Simply stand on the shock jump disc, then press and hold A. The turkey. Yeah, they were on Conan O'Brien. Yeah, that was like their shining moment. To be on Conan O'Brien and then play their first stadium show like a year later. Danny, don't you know? Danny, don't you know? Dude, I fucking love NSP. I love NSP and I love Starbomb. It's a shame the Starbomb's probably not going to be, like, doing any more stuff. But, uh, at least NSP's still going strong. Let's see. Um... Hmm. Whoosh. Shark Food Island? That sounds fun. Nice. What's this? Uh. What is this? Oh. Huh. I don't think I ever did this one. Star Bomb is good until Aaron starts rapping. I could assume that you're not a fan of Aaron's rapping, which is totally okay. I love Star Bomb. I love Aaron and I love uh 
I love uh, NSP. I mean, so, so you basically like NSP then, because without Aaron's rapping, it's literally just NSP. <laughs> I think Aaron's a good rapper. I actually like was kind of surprised when I heard him rap. I was like, he's actually pretty damn good. If you don't like NSP, check out his uh, the two the two songs he did with Nate Wants to Battle. What the fuck is this? Ooh, an egg! That's one of the seven stop and swap items we've been looking for. I reckon it'll unlock something special in my nuts and bolts adventure. Wait, what? Can't wait. Wait, what? Wait. Is this an item to use in nuts and bolts? Wait, huh? I'm confused. Uh. I don't... Oh, you just mean in terms of contrasting with Danny Singh? I get you. It's 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 not for everybody. It's de definitely two very different like types. You prefer NSP? That's fair. I love me some Star Bomb and NSP. I love them both. Oh God, I forgot about the sharks. Oh boy. I think my favorite song of those might be. Uh, Honestly, might be uh, Welcome to My Parents' House. I fucking love Welcome to My Parents' House. It's so funny. It's so catchy. It's just so good. It's hard, though. All their songs are great. Bonk. Ooh. Rip that guy. Welcome to my parents' house. Let's use our inside voices. Ruff. Sometimes my mom just has... <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm curious to see what they're going to play on their acoustic tour, too. Like, we're probably not going to see a lot of their, like, super, like... Um, they're super, like... Like, I probably... We probably will not see Welcome to My Parents' House or, or like, you know, House or Mansion Party. Just because those are... I don't know how they'd be able to pull those off acoustically. What the fuck? Hello? Me leaky no good for water. Can can bear block hole with pebble? Hmm. Um, I would definitely not be surprised to pull out some covers. I'm trying to think of what other song. Danny, don't you know will 100% be played. I know that for a fact. They could do that one acoustically. It'll be interesting to see what they pull out for the acoustic set. Like I said, I'm really excited for it. Oh, Stop and Swap is the thing they tried doing on N64 but didn't work, so they kept it for nuts and... Oh, so, like, if I collect it here, then it actually shows up in nuts and bolts? I'm assuming they had to have done that just for the Xbox versions, right? There's no way they, like... There's no way they, like, had that in the 64 version, then were like, Oh, nuts and bolts is here. Remember all that shit you could grab? Yeah, you could use it there now. Right? Or am I going crazy? That'd be amazing, but... I'm just, like, kind of confused. Like, oh, shit, it's actually going to work for Nuts and Bolts, even though this game technically came out in the 64. Ow, by the way. Wild. All right. That's fucking cool. Fuck. Damn it. Oh, God, Clamp. I think I remember this guy being an asshole. Not dealing with you, Clam. Fucking Clam. I forgot. Banjo's single jump can do most of the work. But nonetheless, for anyone that wants it, Portland, Revolution Hall, Ninja Sex Party, Acoustic Tour, November 4th. Probably like 7 or 8. I don't know the exact time, but uh, I'm hyped as fuck. Only, uh, what, three, almost three months away? That was almost bad. I almost went off the edge there. Alright. 
see if I can make this. Oh, God, no. Okay. Cheese and crackers just wait there. Uh-uh. Coffee and mints. I'll be right over. What the fuck? Oh, there's something in there. Notes! I like how angry these treasure chests are. Like, I just want some treasure. Oh, no, no treasure. Ow. Guess I can't be too close. Ow, oh, waste. Come waste your time with me. Got it. This theme is so good. Oh, be careful not to fall off the edge. Ooh. Follow the clues if you're looking for gold. Okay. Oh, there's an arrow now. Can you believe it? Could you imagine? I gotta remember there's fucking fall damage in this game. All right, their faces get more and more like, oh, uh, we're hurting now. Or just more kind of like, you serious, bro? You're gonna kill us? That's fine. I keep getting those fall damage. This is the first game I played in a while that's actually had fall damage. All right, sir. Ow. So good. Don't you dare. Where's the next clue? Let's just go this way. Hmm. Can I maybe... Fuck. Oh, my aim is so good. Alright, it didn't work. Fuck it. Oh, boy. Don't you dare. Oh, Jiggy. Get Jiggy with it. Na 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 na. Oh, get it. There we go. Watch the mine, though. Mine? Cool. Oh, my God. Sir, step off. Step the hecka back. Hi, Jinjo. Jinjo. Oh, be careful not to fuck this up. Got him. All right, that's eggs. That's fine. Another treasure thing down there. Oh, hello, sir. Bye-bye. All right. Uh, another one of those down there. No, you don't. No, you don't mind. Mine. Oh, no. All right, see what we got over here. Hmm, all right. Oh, right, this freaking guy. I don't remember how to deal with him. Once again, how does this work? All right. Whoosh. Fucking shark food island, dude. Shark bait. Whoa. All right, still going. All right, I gotta find that guy at Pebble too. Oh my god, I can actually see like. I can like see through Banjo's legs. What the hell? What? Oh no, baited. Oh, is that it? Uh, hmm. Bruh, 
I just want the tr to the treasure. Hmm. Maybe this is it over here. I don't know. Yeet. This can't be it, but I'll still grab this one anyway. Yeet. Goal. Once again, why'd you eat it? Hello? Hmm. Sus. Gotta remember to go faster, but I just gotta be careful because I'm not more susceptible to, like, you know, falling off and shit. What was that? Did I see something red over there? The red! It filters through. Maybe it's over. Hmm. Oh no, let's let's go back up. Oh no, it's like. Oh, oh, it's right there. I'm dumb. All right. Well, actually, what's over here though? It's like, there's like a little pathway down over here. Actually, yeah, let's kind of fly around this island to see if there's, like, anything major I'm missing. Oh, hold on. Can't really adjust the camera while I'm flying. Oh, I'm glad I did that. Nice! It is honestly really nice you can just continue flying as long as you have feathers, because then you can really scout out the area. You'd have to be confined to just, you know, the platforms and such. I really like that. I can see why this game was praised. It's very good. I remember enjoying it a lot. It definitely became more of a struggle towards the end, if I remember. But, like, I never finished it. So, maybe, maybe the maybe the reason that I didn't finish it wasn't because I got sucked into the entire Yakuza series. Which I definitely did for, like, a good eight months. On and off stream. And now, you know, redoing it again because Yakuza 0 came back out. And I'll probably just replay the entire series again. But, uh, maybe it's just because, like, it got too hard for me or something. I don't know. Fuck you. Yo, I'll punch a shark in the mouth. I don't care. Oh, maybe I won't. I'm just, just kidding. Just kidding. Thank God you're slow. You're so slow. Mr. Shark Bait. Alright, let's go and see if I can uh, get the treasure. Argumenty. So, hmm. How do I get into the other area? The band is fucking vibing on the back. No. Oh, no shark. Perfect. Hey, I found your treasure, idiot. Yikes. Please open me gently. Gently, he says, huh? There we go. I just realized that molehill is on wood up on the ship. Yeah, uh, that is a good point. Let's actually go back to that, because, um, you know, some something just don't something just don't sit right with me, Supa. Hold on, let's... <laughs> oh, by the way, this ship is called the Salty Hippo. So, um... Hmm. I mean... Uh-huh, sure. That works for me. <laughs> oh, what's this? <laughs> Something is very sus, and it's not a Mungus. Oh my god, why did he get so, like... Why did he get so intense? Got him. There's only one more. Oh, no! Oh. Oh, okay. That works. Yoink. Oh, wait. How do I save, by the way? Or does this game auto-save? I don't remember. Open options? Settings? <laughs> oh, my God, dude. What is this? Crash Team Racing? Or excuse me, Crash Tag Team Racing? Or, you know, also this. Huh? 
the peak of comedy here at Big Fish Dish. I'm just kidding. I couldn't be further from the peak of comedy. I am below farts. All right, let's try that again and actually like go the right way. Actually, what are our totals right now? I should check. Let's see, 73 of 100, five, five of 10, one of two, yikes. Still got a ways to go. Let's go. The peak of comedy in someone's eyes, that's fair. That is fair. Probably mine. In your eyes. The farts, the burps. All right, try this again. Hopefully not fall off the edge this time. The edge of glory. I don't like this physics on the trees. But it's true that I like 6 billion IQ. Oh, this is probably where he is, huh? Oh, never mind. Hmm. Once again, this is very, like, disconcerting. Gulp. Let me just eat that. Alright, let's take a look. Um. Fuck. <laughs> Whoops. Also, this, though. Bonk. Oh, <laughs> shot out of a cannon, dude. Nice. So I still have a ways to go on this one. 81, huh? Ooh, all right. Well, I got to find the pebble for that guy. For that bucket. Oh, Mr. Bucket. Put your balls in my mouth, oh, Mr. Bucket. Balls pop in my mouth, oh, Mr. Bucket. And... Oh, yeah, I think there's another area that's a little bit strange over here. Oh, my God. Okay, we're good. Whew. All right. God, that was close. All right, anyway. Um, fuck. Get down there. Looks like I come in from a different side. Wish I could like see. I was <laughs> I was 100% pushing it there. That was a big monkey s. <laughs> kind of got lightheaded after I did that all for so long because I was like, holy shit! <laughs> all right, we're good. God, what a pussy. Um. Oh, there might be something from the side here. If I remember. Yeah, here we go. Right here. No wonder your ship sank, idiot. <laughs> I don't remember if that's the last one, but it might be. More no tests. Oh, 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 wait, wait, wait. Go back. God, the controls when you're underwater in this specific camera angle are very strange. Actually, yeah, what's on the top of this? Except, you know, life. <laughs> Banjo's fucking, like, bear doggy paddle is so good. It's a great swimming animation. He swims better than I do. Just air. The source... Well, not the source of life, but a major source of life. Hey, Miss Mr. Bucket, where's your goddamn pebble? Put the pebble in my mouth, Mr. Bucket. Oh, what the fuck was that? Oh, right. Charging beak. Life finds a way. Um, see this the, la the guy's last thingamajig? Hey, did I do it, forehead? Uh. Christ. 
Okay, bye. Thanks, man. Warsh. All right, so that's done. That little escapade with Burpy McBurpa Man. All right, so that's seven to ten. There's two more. It's a fucking pebble. Oh, yeah, this area. This is another area that's a little bit strange. Oh, fuck, I tried to bait him. I got baited instead. I'm not sure that was necessary. I got forked hard there. Okay, six, seven, eight. I love how they're both just kind of like, eh. We're not, we're not feeling the best, but we're also not feeling the worst, I guess. We're just kind of complacent. All right, this area. What is this area? Yes, this was the area I remember getting confused on a bit. Banjo Kazooie. So, I'm going to guess I just have to put it in. Hopefully this is right. I think this was the part you're talking about, yeah. Uh, there it is. Joe. The Z! Wait, actually, where is the Z? Oh, there it is. There was something different to this. Hold on. I remember doing this one, but it took me a little while to figure out. How did I drain this last time? Because, yeah, you ha you do have to drain this. I remember that. Um, I think it was something from the outside. Can I get the damn thing? Oh, please. Oh, please, the keys. They're not in the ignition. Must have wound up on the floor. We were switching our positions. Okay, where the fuck? Let's go. Um... How did I do this last time? I mean, we need to just, like, fucking go hard on this. was the trick uh yeah just just make a hole forehead obviously um man i don't remember this one yeah i can't remember either it's fine unless i just need to like one <laughs> that's not gonna work two oh wait, maybe it will two three Nope. Uh, maybe there was something actually in that. I feel like I had to drain this entire, like, little lake, though. I remember being confused on this one for a while. Oh, 
Oh, what was it? Oh, I can't remember. I literally can't remember how I did this before. Oh, you know what? I think I might have needed a different character. I think I needed, like, a different being or something. Like, from, uh, Ikabukum. Alright, we'll come back to that later. Alright, now I gotta find this damn guy's pebble, but I don't know where the hell it is. Pebbles and Bam Bam. Mmm, fruity pebbles. So good. I do have to be careful, though, because I am low. Oh, actually, let's get some health back. Oh, you bitch. Leading me to shark infested waters. Please? God, the hit detection in this game is pretty rough. Alright, now we're looking better. Okay, where the hell is your pebble, Jabroneth? Hmm. I'm also only missing like six notes, too. This is one of those games I'll most likely need a guide for. This is also if I go for the 100%, which I'm not 100% sure if I'll... I'm not 100% if I'll go. 100%. Right, this fucking guy. Crustacean brain. Let's try it, shellhead. No. Also... That's funny. Oh, what the fuck was his deal? I don't remember. Alright, where's your damn pebble, Jabroneth? Oh, uh, no. Was this something where I just had to, like... Was an eco bookum behind him. Hold on. That didn't work. All right, that didn't work. It didn't work as I intended. <laughs> the fucking music getting faster though. Faster and puppets. Yeah, I don't remember how to do either of those. I feel like I did him, but maybe I didn't. It's been too long. Oops. <laughs> Got a little janky there for a second. Let's go back up this way. For a hot minute. Oh, maybe this guy's a pebble? Do you have a pebble? Blow up. Blow up, pussy. You won't. I guess he actually won't. Good job, man. Good job not taking the peer pressure. I appreciate you. Um, that's what the one-up was. I was gonna say, I cannot... Yeah, I can't climb up that. Hmm. I think it's just... I don't remember how to do, like, most of the shit... Kind of look around real quick. Um, because we went that way. We already checked that treasure chest. There's nothing. Oh, oh, that's the lighthouse. We don't need to do that. Let me kind of fly around and see if I can spot something. Yeah, maybe there's something else over by the chest. Uh, does it look like there is? Yeah, there's nothing there. There's nothing in that one because that was just a uh, mine. Mine. I don't think there's anything else up here. Unless I get like really high up. Holy shit, I'm really high up. <laughs> I think I've hit the uh, edge. 
All right, um, boy, this is nerve-wracking. Um, actually, let me fly around a shark, shark eaten island. Actually, I just don't remember how to do this. There's something behind this. Oh, nope. Invisible wall. Rip. Hmm. I also might have to grab the pebble from another level, too. Ow. Am I gonna have to look up a guide for fucking level two? Well, granted, I didn't say I was gonna go for 100%, but... You know. Also six notes left too. Six, seven, and one. Or shoot, six, three, and one. My bad. Well, we got most everything on our first roundabout. Like I said, I'm probably gonna have to go back to most of these levels again. Either with the mandatory backtracking or just me trying to find everything. I feel like I've already explored this level front to back pretty much. Oh, maybe not, though. Hold on. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, my doom. Oh, no. Jaws, please. God, why? I got baited. All right, you fuck. Maybe I can, like, hit him from behind or something? Okay, nope. This guy doesn't give a shit. Alright, alright, fine. You win. You win this round, bitch. I'm coming back for you, though. How do you defeat these freaking clams? Maybe this is where I do like this move. You can't fly? I can. I most certainly can fly. Is I was gonna say, like, do I ground pound that, that shell guy? I don't know, because I tried that. It didn't work. No, I just learned the, uh, the flight and, like, the high jump. I feel like the pebble might be in another area. So I was like, yeah, maybe I could just, like... Shit, that's not what I meant. Whoops, my bad. I was like, oh, I'll just ground pound the, the, what was the name, Nipper? I'll ground pound him from a, from a safe high distance, and it did not work. Fucking Keck W. Ripperoni. I mean, I'll try one more time, but I'm probably going to get freaking bodied right here. Which is fine. We try and actually get, like, his claw. Or actually, no, let's just go over the... Yeah, see, he doesn't give a shit, dude. Unless I can, like... Yeah, he doesn't care. Alright, alright, fine. I'll leave you be for now. I guess. But I want so bad to cook him up in a stew. Also still missing, like, six notes, and that pisses me off.
You spin me right. I'm just kidding. God, those guys are annoying. They hop around everywhere. There we go. Sorry, itchy nose. like nothing over there. Oh, there's something right here, though. Oh, also, uh, mega hype for, uh, the second Mario Kart 8, uh, booster course pack. Just got announced today. And, uh, some, some real good tracks, man. I like the first one, but the second one's gonna blow it out of the park. The biggest ones, though, fucking Waluigi Pinball is coming back, baby. It's coming to Mario Kart 8, and I'm so excited. It was... Waluigi Pinball, Shroom Gorge from the Wii, which is, or, sorry, Mushroom Gorge from the Wii, which is really good. Uh, Calamari Desert from 64. There was a new track that was based around, like, candy, I think. Um, Snowland from the Game Boy, which I've never heard of. Uh, SNES Mario Circuit 3, which is kind of meh. And then two, there were two tracks from Tor, which were Sydney Sprint and New York Minute. So, but I mean, come on, dude. Waluigi Pinball and Mushroom Gorge automatically make that worth it. I'm super excited to play both of those. But I'm also excited to see the new track because they made a brand new track for this, uh, for this, uh, this pack. Comes out on August 4th. Of course, it comes out a day after my mom and I stream, but, you know, whatever. But anyway, a little side note on that. I'm super excited for that, especially for Waluigi's Pinball. That's like one of my favorite tracks. I know it was in Mario Kart 7, but I'm glad they put it on a console version because n myself and a lot of other people did not get to play Mario Kart 7 because I did not ha own a uh, 3DS. And that was like, it was on the DS and they remade it for the 3DS, but I never played 7. Oh, fuck, by the way. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, Jaws, please. Oh. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, my God. All right. I think I'm going to um, get out of this level for now. I feel like I've gotten as much as I possibly freaking can. Um, and we'll move on to the next level. However, I'll look up... I mean, if I can't like figure out this shit, I'll look it up later. Like I said, I will... Even though if it's not necessarily mandatory backtracking, I will try to go back to these levels multiple times over. Oh! Wait, never mind. Hold on. Oh, no. Oh, again. Why are you like everywhere, though? Shark Everywhere from Yakuza. The shark actually looks pretty good for N64. Oh, why could you not have just given it to me? Oh, a gamer pick. Cool. So, so good. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh. <sighs> that was cutting it, like, even close than the last one. All right, let's get the hell out of here before Jaws freaking eats my ass. And not in the good way. I mean, what? Next level. Like I said, I'll go back to that one eventually. I think we still have, what, two? Like, six, two, and that's it? Yeah, we got everything from Mumbo's Mountain. We missed six, two. Yeah, so six and two. All right. That's not too bad. Maybe what I'll do is I'll just do this game like semi, semi 100% and then we'll, and maybe on like the last stream we'll go back and grab the rest of the shit or something with a guide. Something like that. We'll see though. Maybe I won't need it. A grunty pounding. That sounds awful. Sounds like a sex move. I don't want that. Ow. Ouch. Oh, yeah, this was here. Cool. Yoink. Go. Okay. Let's, uh, there's nothing else in here, right? Oh, wait, is there something behind the treasure chest? Whoop, 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 camera. Uh, nope. All right. All right. Gotta keep going faster by doing this. This, like, doubles the speed. 
Yeet. So I can go back up there, but let's, uh... Oh, wait, no, we already went down there. There was, like, nothing but sadness down there. So let's go down here. But now, there's three different ways to go. I can go that way. But let's go this way. What's over here? Let's start exploring the hub world a little bit. Hopefully I don't get lost. This is the one thing. Bonk. Oh, cauldron. Hey, man. You've activated a magic cauldron. Find two the same color to create a shortcut. Did I already find another one with you? I don't remember. No, okay. Oh, there's gotta be something atop this pipe, right? I mean, come on. Haha! -ha! There sure was. Not like the best thing to find, but I'll still take it. I guess I can't go this way yet. Karate's got the lasting charm. You sure fucking don't, though, actually. You are lying to everybody involved. Ooh, hello. What's that? Oh, you bitch. Ooh, gold? Oh, don't choke. Lucky you, I'm an invulnerability. Oh, yeah, bottles will tell you more. 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 Okay. All right, now let's see if we can try going up here. Just because I fucking can. This is where I'm going to start getting lost. Ooh, music change. Hmm. Alright, that didn't do shit. Hmm. Oh, what the fuck is this? Oh, TV got a picture of the pipes. That's funny. Okay. So what the fuck is this? Oh, wait. I don't know what that is. <laughs> ah, now it all makes sense. I knew that looked out of place. Right, I can't go that way yet. Shit. Wires. Alrighty, what's up here? Oh, hello. Alright, what do you got for me? Grunty wears a flea circus under that repulsive dress. Fucking gross, dude! Got this nasty pet dog. His name is Ripper. <laughs> Grunty and the bro Broomstick Boys. Yeah, they sound pretty awful. Ooh, what is this? Ah! Open CC. Oh! No, you don't. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You can't go underwater, bitch, or else you die. How sad. How sad for you. I'm gonna be a little bit greedy here. Grab some air. Go back down. Shut up! I'll be waiting in the loft. Alright, that's a dead end. Alright, cool. Another t not Oh my god, that fucking sound actually scared me. Ding, ding It's so loud. Why is it so loud? Ooh. 
bubble gloop swamp, huh? Well, I have enough, but I don't know if this is the next level, so let's go back to that uh, one door. At least you know that we've unlocked this for the future. Bubble gloop. What a great name. What great names, Grunty. Don't you guys love my favorite band, Bubble Gloop and the Gloop Boys? All right, once we get out of the water, incoming loud-ass sound effect. Okay. All right, yeah, let's actually go to the door now. Hundred eighty, bitch. I have enough. Take a bow. Take a bow. All right. You. Ooh. Bonk. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, wait. Wasn't there a... Hold on. Hold on a second. Wasn't there a freaking, like, jump pad I could go to in the first... I just realized that after I saw that one. Oh, crap. Ran right into that guy. Glad they put a freaking walking brick wall in the way. She's a brick wall. I think it was right over here. Yes, here we go. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Clamper's Cavern. Sure. If you want to place all your pieces into the picture... Just press the right trigger. Oh, perfect. I would love to do that. Thanks. All right, that's the next level. Clamper's Cavern. Oh, look, it's back over there. Or sorry, Clanker's Cavern. My bad. All right, level three. Here we go. What great sound effects. Yeet. Oh, cool. My shit stayed activated. Nice. Oh, I stink of gloop. You'd think I'd be able to get the platformer down to platformer, right? <laughs> Not on Big Fish Dish. When you're here, you're here. And that's it. All right, Clankers Kevin. One new move, huh? All right, I guess we'll just go down. Ooh, we're in like bad goo water. I don't like it. Oof. But a bit of them. You know, one thing I appreciate, how freaking fast Banjo climbs up, like, ladders and trees. It's really nice. It's a lot faster than most games. Oh, right, these guys. I remember these guys. They're annoying. But I bet you're in the wall. As long as I do that beforehand, we're good. Nice. I know your fucking tricks, bitch. I got your number now. So call me... No. Oh, hey, man. Just hiding behind this freaking thing. I guess I don't really blame you. Looks like an accordion, sort of. Yup. Banjo turned to fucking Link there. Whoa! All right, let's see what we got down here. Oh, God. Smooth transitions. Okay, these are all eggs, it looks like. Egg. All right, well, let's just go down the one place I can, I guess. Hit 
detection is so bad. Turning around in the water is not very easy, by the way, either. There we go. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, God. Hit detection. Oh, my goodness. Hello. Oh, you are... You are huge. I am Clinker, which is garbage grinder. Clinker, not like dirty water. Want fresh air. Holy crap, that is a big, big robot shark. Oh, I need to get some fucking air. Speaking of air, I need it first, bitch. Um. Alright, there's a lot to explore here. Oh, you definitely sound a little, uh, a little clanky. Uh-uh. Not this time. Oh, you're also, like, damaged. Damn. Damaged. <laughs> Jesus. It's like an old rusty car. Hmm. Just can't go over there yet. All right, fair enough. Game for Oh my god, camera, please. All right, let's see if I can free Clanker. Get in some air. Ooh, hold on. Sorry, you're gonna have to wait, Clanker. I got exploring to do. Oh my god. Why? Kind of get lined up. There we go. Now we're in business. I right, go back up for some air. Okay, and go back down. Ooh. Take these chains off. Take them off of my belly. Oh my god, this like actually got spooky. Why is this so spooky? Uh how do I uh do I just go through it like a few times? Hi, I'm Gloop. Grab my bubbles if you're low on air. Oh sweet, thanks man. Thank you, Gloop. Hey we free clanker. I guess not really freed him, but we gave him some air. Poor guy. Oh, I speaking to air. Gloop, where are you? Oh. Okay, cool. Oh my god, this is like actually mis like spooky. That fucking like violin or whatever. That synth. Yeah, hold on, Jinjo. And like the freaking. Does it make it that much better? I feel like I'm gonna get eaten by a like dirty shark. Oh god. I need that. Uh oh. Okay. Gloop, you are my savior. Okay, there we go. Sorry, there's like water in my cheek that was actually making an itch. Uh. Alright, well, at least that kind of, like, satiated the bloodlust of this cave. Gloop, you're the best. I gotta go now, buddy. I'm gonna feel like I'm gonna die here. You've been great, but I don't want this to be my tomb. Uh. Alright, we're good. Good, jeez. So loud. There you go, buddy. You feeling better now? Hell yeah, Clanker. <laughs> oh, the eyes actually follow me. Oh, that's fucking... That's good detail. It's like, or... Nice! 
Is that two? Oh, it's the first one. Eat too much garbage. No, not your teeth, bro. Gotta keep your chompers pearly white. Alright, hold on, buddy. That was a golden one. Oh, I wonder if I have to hit this with like an egg. Ah, uh, I think so. My aim is so good. Stand still, you fuck. Fuck. Right. Man, that, that was annoying. It's really hard to aim this thing with the, uh, just the left stick. not hurt now. Teeth all better now. Thank you, Bear. Bear, Bear Grylls here. I'm pressing, the wrong, I'm pressing the wrong button. Whoops. There we go. I wonder why I was pressing the different button there. Alright, cool. Now I can go in the teeth. Wow, cool, I just landed right in a crab. Sir, that was bad. This is awkward. <laughs> this is a really awkward angle. Oh, shit. Ah, crap. Oh, God, no, not the spooky music again. Oh, God, I'm gonna die. There we go. Oh, these guys have two. Oh, you fucking, of course you would. Oh, God, spooky. Getting spooped. Oh, what the hell is this? Fucking hentai in here? Bitch. There we go. Oh, I keep falling in this mouth. Stop it. Stop falling in the mouth. This place always creeped me out. It's pretty scary. It's, but the music doesn't help either. The freaking, like, continuous synth. It's like in every horror movie cliche. Yeah, it just looks gross. It's, like, clearly a robot, but they tried to make it more, like... You know, more like animalistic with all the red and shit. That sound doesn't help. And there's also hentai in here, which is never good. Oh god, they're so floppy. Oh, what is this, Superman 64? What the fuck? Brannant. Um, rust or fleshy bits. Yeah, it's it's pretty, it's pretty not cool. Whatever it is, it's not cool. Also, time missions. Gotta love them. Which one is next? Oh, it's not one of these. Oh boy. Oh no. How? I'm definitely not making this. Unless I get real fucking lucky. Oh, there's no way. There's no way. Oh, no, there's one more. Oh, I, all right. Restart. 
Oh, don't give me that. Don't give me that shit. I got this. Alright, we got this, dude. That was still pretty close, yeah. Seems like there might be a little bit of room for leeway. I'm already doing much better. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We got this in the fucking bag, baby. Watch me choking now because I'm getting cocky. Don't get cocky. If that is the last... Watch there be one more, like, way over there. Oh, God. I don't like that. Yay! I'm a fucking baller. Is that what the kids are saying nowadays? I'm a fucking G. Yes. Cool. Once again, I guess I guess those jiggies are made out of fucking chocolate. If Kazooie's just freaking eating them. We'll go there in a second. Wait, how many of these can I have? I just realized. Alright, we don't have that many, so I guess we'll see. Probably 50, I guess. Alright, what do we got over here? Kazooie's just actively using herself as the backpack, pretty much. Well, that's what I mean. Like, how the fuck does she fit in there? <laughs> Literally. It makes, like, no sense. What's out here? She is the backpack. Oh, my God. Hey, Mole, what do we got here, buddy? This move uses Biko's wings as a shield against the bad guys. Cool. Does it make me in invulnerable? Sure does. Hold the right or left trigger and push the right stick right. Keep the right or left trigger held and use the left stick to move around. Wait, what? Really carry to okay ten. You learn all my new moves to the sl okay. Okay, hold on. So it's wait, hold on. There we go. No chance. This area took me so long to figure out how to get to, not gonna lie. Did you do the uh, rings thing? Because once you get the rings thing, the freaking, like, other thing is, like, right there, I guess. Oh, shit. How do I do that again? Oh, it literally is pressing right. That's weird. Alright, cool. What the fuck is this, by the way? Child me didn't know though. A oh, long ago, yes, child me didn't know. That's fair. First time I played this level, I remember getting stuck a few times too. I'm not gonna lie either, because I was like, "How the fuck do I get Clanker like above?" And I was like, "Oh, there's this whole, there's this big hole down there." I didn't even realize. Because someone's burping too. Oh God, not again. What's this? Oh. Interesting. Oh, wow, there's like multiple entrances and exits. That's pretty fucking cool, actually. Also, what's... Oh, my God. Jinjo, you don't deserve that. Let me get you out of here, buddy. Jiggy, jiggy. Get jiggy with a na 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 All right, let's see if there's anything else I need to do. Oh, yeah, I didn't go down this way, did I? Or, you know, that's the way I came from. Wait, is it? Oh, it had to have been. Yeah. Was there anything over here? Hold on. Oh, wasn't there like... I think there was a place like an exit above. So hold on. Okay, let me make sure I'm not missing anything down here either. There's some eggs. Oh, jeez. Why? Eggs and feathers. The banjo kazooie story. I guess the kazooie story. It'd be like her uh, documentary. It'd be like Talladega Nights, the, you know, the, the ballad of Ricky Bobby or whatever the fuck. 
If you ain't first, you're last. To sit in high-pitched stringed instruments for tension. Dude, it's a horror staple classic. Much like Talladega Nights. I gotta watch that again. It's so fucking good. Oh, hell, Bobby. I was high when I said that. It'll make a lick of sense. You ain't first or last. You could be second, third, fourth. Hell, you could even be fifth. <laughs> it's like, oh my god, my entire life's a lie. Also, um, what am I doing here? Oh, okay. I guess I can't exit this way. Weird. Fucking weird, dude. I'm all hopped up a Mountain Dew. Okay. Uh, what have we gotten this so far? <laughs> three of ten. All right, three of ten. None of the honeycombs and like half of the freaking things. All right, so there's a whole bunch of shit I could do over here, so I might as well try it. Why is there why is there a bobcat in my car? Hmm, what's this? What does that lead to? I guess this. I guess so. Ah. Wee. Alright, so that's that. Oh my god. Right. Okay, that's good. Shake and bake. Okay. Oops. How's this? Can I wall jump? Oh, dude, imagine if I could wall jump. That'd be pog. I'm gonna come at you like a spider monkey. Holy shit, dude. Dude, I, I just have to, like, maybe not watch the whole movie again just because I haven't been. I don't really watch that many movies nowadays, but, like, look up clips on YouTube of some of the funniest moments because, goddamn, that movie is so fucking funny. It's so good. And Walker and Texas Ranger, what great names. Jinjo! Right, we have one more in this level. Yeah, so it seems like it auto saves whenever you get a Jiggy, which is nice. Or, or a Jinjo. Whenever you get like a main item, it auto saves, so that's nice. There's not really a save system, it just kind of does it whenever it wants. Boogaloo! I love at the end too when they both wreck their cars, and then they just sprint to the finish line, which disqualifies both of them. <laughs> like, well, that doesn't count, unfortunately. <laughs> They're just like so determined. I just went the wrong way. Whoops. Oh, wait, I think I might remember one more spot. Yeah, hold on. Let's get back up on uh, Clinker's, Clinker's big frickin' forehead. And it has something to do with this. Ha-ha! What the fuck? Oh, I feel like I shouldn't go that way yet. Get out of my way!
Nice. Go huh? All right, cool. Ah, oh, now I see why I couldn't go that way, because it's like, it's only a closing area. I'm not sure why I did that, by the way. I didn't need to fly. You've got to fly, damn it. I'm so high, I can hear heaven. Name the song. Just kidding. Name the song. It's it, iconic, quintessential, classic. Someone told me. Anyway. All right, so what the fuck area have I been to and haven't been to yet? Okay, I think I've been here. Yeah, definitely been here already. Oh, there's more like notes just right over here. Dude, I just got baited. I got baited by the jewels. God damn it, I'm not meaning to do that. Oh, he takes two of my fucking health, too. There we go. Need like all of these to recuperate. Please. Alright, um, check up here. Oh. Oh, here we go. Single note. What the fuck? I suck. I don't know why I did that. Whoops. There we go. Nice. Oh my god, can... Wait, can I not have more than nine lives? Are you... Really? I can only have up to nine lives? That's it? That is not a lot. Huh. I, honest to god, never knew that. Wow, really? I guess nine lives, nine times to die. Trying to make it difficult. Hmm. Oh, you know. Just shoot eggs at a wall until it opens. Don't worry about it. <laughs> or shoot, I should get, I guess you say, uh, shoot eggs at a grate until it opens. Wrong button. Oh, hold on. Oh, shit. I was about to make a 69 joke, and then I got one more by accident. Forever live on in our memories. Forever. Um... Oh, I think this is the same spot I was at before. Hmm. All right, let's, cut, let's start going down here again to see if I can find some more shit. Oh, what's this? I don't think I've been here yet. Don't play the spooky music, please. Don't spook me. What's this? Whoa, whoa. Oh! Snippet mutants are we. Jigsaw is ours. Fight us. You must. Okay. I'm gonna 
fucking pwn y'all. Maybe not pwn, but... Alright, if I could... There we go. Alright, cool. You've activated my many trap cards. This music got fast-paced real... Like, real fast. Uh... Boom, he had no idea. That motherfucker had no idea. Beaten snippet mutants, are we? Yours is friends. He just like held up the flag and said, you win. <laughs> All right, fine. This music, though. Bum, 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 Yeet. I like how the music's still going even with the, uh, like, you got a jigsaw music. That's pretty funny. It's, like, very quick and, like, peppy. Alright, cool. So that was something I hadn't done yet. There's still four more jigsaws in here? Probably the third or fourth time we've been in this pipe. Oh, maybe not though? A different one? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, but also I need to get out of here quickly because I have like no air. Oh no. Oh, I'm running into walls. Oh, I'm panicking. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh God, I'm stuck. Oh no, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh my god, I didn't die. Whew, that was close. That was very, very, very close. Okay, so let's see. Where else have I not been to? Sorry, my nose itches for some reason. Well, I haven't been up here, but I don't really know how to get up to this area. Oh wait, what's up there? Oh, oh, I remember. I remember now. Oh, what the fuck? What just happened? Uh, Donnie? Yes, I do remember. You get on top of this bad boy. Cool. All right. Let's actually kind of take a look, too. So I still need to go the... Oh, there's a pipe. Oh, I didn't even see that. All right. Carefully. Oh. I keep forgetting it's literally right. Nice. Alright, two more jiggies to go. I think there's a lot of notes either, though. Alright, ten notes. So we still haven't found any of the honeycomb. And then two more jiggies. I feel like we're making better progress on this level than we did with uh, uh, the coast. Or the Pirate's Cove. At least. I gotta remember to start turning my fucking fan over this direction when I stream. It's if you haven't, uh, if you can't tell, I'm a little bit sweaty. Uh, it's been pretty damn warm in Oregon. It hasn't been as hot as Arizona, thank God, but it's uh, it's gonna hit 100 two days in a row, and it was like 97 today, so it's a bit a bit warm. Ain't gonna lie. Mmm, I don't know if those are the last ten. It's like five there. Yo. Hmm, what if the last ones are like on the bottom or something? Alright, so let's see here. Oh, another Jinjo too. Nice. 
Perfect. What the fuck? Okay, I probably shouldn't go there yet. Do this just to make sure I don't fall. Oh god, hit detection, please. Hmm. Oh, honeycomb, nice. All right, there's one of them. Uh, let's go back up there. There might be something hidden other than a Jinjo in um the you know what's of the uh, of the the thingamajig. Like, what I mean is in here. Oh, no. Just eggs. Oh, and another one-up that I don't need. Hey, thanks, game. Thank you so much for that one-up that is, like, actually useless right now. Literally useless one-up because I've already got max lives, even though lives only up to nine. All right. So, what do we have? One more jig, five more notes, and one more honeycomb. All right. I feel like I should be able to find these. Um, can I take a look around real quick? Hey, once again, I feel like I've been everywhere, but it's highly possible that I've missed a crucial, crucial spot. Let's go underwater again. Oh yeah, aren't, there's two pipes right here. I wonder if there's something in these ones other than eggs and shit. Maybe it's a jiggy. Alright, this one is just eggs. That one, I believe, was just notes, and I think I got all of them, but I'll double check these pipes again. Right, this one is just feathers. still wild that you can only get 99 lives. Or excuse me, 99. Jesus Christ. Now, I'm thinking of Mario. Uh, 9. Okay, yeah, it looks like there's nothing in here. I think I already got the shit that was in here. I think. Yep. Okay. Alright, so, hmm. Only missing a few things, but I don't know where they are. That's the issue, isn't it? Might be in Clanker, but I feel like I got everything in Clanker already. The issue now is just like figuring out which which areas I haven't 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 been to yet. Like I, I think this is the beginning, but let's actually go back there and see if there's something I missed. There might have been. All right, some eggs. That's fine. Yeah, there is this whole area, but I don't recall there being any other secret shit. More eggs. <laughs> Jesus. Right, there was that guy up there, but he's not really that important. Um, let's at least like destroy him and see if some, maybe maybe he's holding like a secret jiggy or something like that. Cause who knows, man? You never know. I didn't realize you were still alive. God damn it! Ow! Ooh, the wombo though. Freaking knock me off the edge, you bitch! All right, time for you to die. Deal with it. Not my fault. Fudge. Big rip. All 
Okay, now that is just exactly what I expected. Um, hmm. Hmm. I am not 100% sure. I guess maybe I'll check Clinker one more time. That's the only thing I can think of that there might be something there. Or maybe the bottom. I didn't check the bottom again. Although I don't think there was anything else there, though. Who knows? Maybe there was, though. You have to like unchain them or something. Cause yeah, there's this whole there's like this anvil is kind of still just like you know bringing them down. Thank you, Gloop. Maybe if I do it again or something. Doesn't seem to be doing anything. So this is maybe I do like go through these chains or something. Maybe there's like a way to break his chains from like this spot. Alright, yeah, let's check the inside of Clanker one more time. And then I'll probably end the stream after that, because we'll, we'll be on to another level after we're done here, even if I don't find the last Jiggy and stuff. Like I said, we're probably going to have to go back at all these levels again anyway. Because we already went here. Oh, but was there another way to go over here? Hold on. Could have sworn there might have been one more way to go. This way. What's this way? Oh, okay. That's just back to the beginning. Okay. Let's let's see. Let's just make sure I'm not missing anything over here. There also might be like. Oh, right. There's a jiggy on his other tooth. Right. I forgot about that. I went in the wrong tooth. Now let's just see if, if, you know, there's any more notes over here that I may have missed. Don't think there was, but like I said, you never know. We'll grab that Jiggy in a minute. That'll be the last one, thankfully. Um, duh, dissonant high-pitched stringed instruments for tension. This is where the Jinjo was, I believe. Yeah, there's nothing else down here. Okay. I don't like it. Don't like it one bit. All right, so now we got to go in the right tooth. Well, le our left, but his right. Oh, do you think maybe there's other fins? Hold on. Oh, there is. Nice. All right, that's the last Jiggy. Nice. All right, cool. We got uh, all the jigsaws, all the pieces in this one. So what? It, what happens if I go in this one? 
I just realized. Son of a bitch. This game really makes you think, huh? There you go. Oh, did I just miss this? Oh, I think I may have just missed this. Yeah, I totally did. It was right here the whole time. All right, cool. I got everything except for the last honeycomb. I wonder where that is, actually. Oh, rad. Actually, let me, let me just see if I can find where the last honeycomb is on this one. Banjo. Kazooie. Um, all honeycomb pieces. This is not giving. This is just a wiki. <laughs> uh, let's. See. This is a game fact guide. It's text only. That one's, that one's kind of tricky, huh? It's, it's fucking in here. Wow, damn, dude. Nice. I don't think I ever would have found that. All right, cool. Well, that's 100% on uh, Clinker's Cavern. Nice. I only had to use a guide for that one, uh, that one honeycomb piece. That's all right, though. All right, anyway, uh, let's get out of this level. Let's at least get to the next level, which I believe is the swamp. We'll unlock that, and then we'll uh, we'll call it a stream. We'll be back with more of this tomorrow. Oh, can I just, like, exit level? Oh, no, I can only exit game. What's well, it we press to select? Nothing, okay. Jack diddly shit. All right, now how did I get back? Oh, yeah, this way. All right, cool. Well, we got 100% of level. That's not Mumbo's Mountain. Nice. That was a cool level. I like I like that one. Good old Clanker's Cavern. Shout out to Clanker. Big old robot shark who eats trash. Guy's got a pretty rough, rough life and job, but hey, he sticks through. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Alright. Sweet. Okay, so the I think the unlock is right over here, yeah. I wonder why the number nine is blue now. It's got like the egg color. Alright, Bubble Gloop Swamp, I believe, is next. Nice! Ooh. 
bubble gloop a swamp. Alright, cool. Let's just get back to the main hub and then we'll uh, call it. Shut up. <laughs> I'm the master. The master debater. Or the master exploder. I did not mean, did not mean to blow your mind, to blow your mind. Actually, there's something else in this hub world I can do, I believe. Did these like eyes pop up or something? Yeah, here we go. Bonk. Bonk. Bitch. All right. Oh. All right, now let's get to the uh, next area. All right, so I don't remember which way it was. I remember it was over here. Oh, 260. Alright, I have enough of that, but let's go the other way. Oh my god, don't want to fuck with that. Oh, hey. In a... <laughs> in a... Du she sleeps in a dumpster? Sweatiest socks competition, good lord. Fat Hag Monthly. Fucking Fat Hag Monthly. Damn, son. You really don't like your sister, do you? I mean, fair enough, right? Do you? Um, okay. I just cut her off. This way? Oh! What is that sound effect? What the fuck? Literally what it would sound like if you had, like, water in your shoes. Oh, hey. Fat old sister's favorite sport is... What did that say? Loogie what? Cauldron College. Eating a bucket of beans? Dude, that sounds like my party trick. If that could even be considered such a thing. Alright, cool. Bubble Gloop Swap. Nice! Alright, let's at least get in here. I don't know if, like... You know. Oh. What the fuck? Alright, let's see if I can... Exit. I don't know if it'll, like... Hopefully it auto-saved. It should have. Oh, no. Oh, did I lose? No, I lost. I think, maybe. What the fuck? Kids game, by the way. Oh my god, dude. Come back to Mumbo's skull. Ooh, sorry, 2D. <laughs> I guess I got game over. Well, actually, let me go back in the game and see where it saved me. Hopefully it didn't, like, fuck me over. Yo, kids game, by the way. <laughs> What the fuck? Alright, like I said, we're, we're gonna end the stream in a second, but I just want to see where it puts me. I want to see if it actually puts me in the level. 
All right, run game three. Hey, 32 jigsaws and 294 notes in the first stream. That's not too bad, actually. Oh, right. I forgot. No matter where you go, it puts you in the fucking beginning. I forgot about that. That is one annoying thing. It puts you at the beginning no matter what. Look at Tootie. She played the flutie. <laughs> Your sister wants... Oh! Anyway. Oh, didn't I? I wanted to see how many games I had, right? In my uh, games and apps. <laughs> 148. I was seriously misjudging. All of these to play. Now, granted, some of them are Yakuza. Like, as you can see, I've re-downloaded all of... Oh, yeah, there's Ukulele, by the way. But, I mean, shit, I've got... I played all the Yakuza's, which I'm going to play again because I fucking love them. Uh, I have... Uh, we got Watch Dogs I never played. Witcher, Viva Pinata, Volatron, Rainbow Six Vegas, Z -Z 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 Titanfall. I got to play Titanfall's 2 story. And and uh, Halo Infinite. Got to replay Force Unleashed one of these days. Super Meat Boy. Fucking... I need to find... I need to buy the other Shantae. Shadow Warrior fucking Rocket Knight. I mean, dude, so Resident Evil 1. So many fucking games I need to play. Holy crap, I didn't even realize it was that many. Some of these I'll probably never play, but like, you got the... Oh yeah, I gotta play the Lego Star Wars games and then play the new ones. By the way, most of these were free with gold, by the way. Just want to point that out. Let's do it. Nah, I'm just kidding. Fucking <laughs> Hydro Thunder. Remember when we unironically played Hydro Thunder Hurricane for like, what? five minutes <laughs> in, his, in his screen in a fucking stream that was funny anyway thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate you very very much hope you enjoyed banjo kazooie part one be back tomorrow with more part two gonna keep playing this until i finish it and then we'll get back into call of duty uh we'll be playing modern warfare 2 campaign remastered next like i said i'm gonna play all three of the original modern warfares leading up to the uh, modern warfare 2 open beta which i did not realize was in september i thought it was august my bad which means I just have more time to play different games in between. Uh, but yeah, we'll play this, finish up Banjo-Kazooie, maybe 100% it, not 100% sure on that yet. Play uh, MW2 Remastered. Uh, then we'll play Yakuza 2, OG Yakuza 2 on the emulator. Then we'll play MW3, and then we'll play probably Banjo-Tooie. So uh, that's the plan for the next, like, probably few weeks. Yeah, anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Appreciate you. To any lurkers that were in chat, you guys are the backbone of Twitch and this channel, so thank you for lurking. And of course, as always, Anyone watching this on YouTube, peace out. I love you, and I hope you enjoyed YouTube. Peace. Bye.